morning everyone it's monday morning serve another week <laughs> unfortunately i'm not feeling very great this morning had a bad few days actually anyway um i thought i would start a vlog today because i have fun if it's been one of those weeks so i thought i might just do like a few days or a weekly vlog or something like that we'll see how things go but at the moment that's the impression i get it's school holidays but Athena is up now in hospital, back in the rehab hospital. So um, I've got to take Tara to a few appointments. Um, Christy's home. Mum and Dad are home. They got home yesterday too. But yeah, I just feel it's going to be a crazy week. Especially if I'm not feeling great, I'm just going to get done. So I thought I'll start filming and I'll try and share bits and pieces. Just trying to know if I've got anything else to update you on. I don't particularly think so. I had a pretty quiet weekend because I wasn't having a good one. Went out for lunch yesterday to the temple. I did take a smidge of video, so I'll put that in here. But that was really nice. That was the five of us went out for lunch, so that was really nice. And we just um, didn't go too far because Athena was having a bad pain day, as was myself. So we just went for a little walk down to the... Oh, God. The little lake thing. I can't think what the word... Pond? The pond. And just out there for a little while, it was really nice out yesterday. It's been pretty warm. As you can see, I have opened up the house and it's a beautiful day out there. I don't know why I have to feel bad on these beautiful days. I'd love to go for a walk down by the lake, but I've got to take one of the puppies, so I guess that is the only thing. They're just lying behind me on the floor. Bailey's due to go back to the vets today to get his stitches out. He's doing all right. I think I'm gonna go up and have a shower now. Fingers crossed that I feel a little bit better after that. And I'll just go get my normal, try and get my normal stuff done. I don't know. I'm just so achy. I wake up my body on fire again. And I'd sort of forgotten what that was like. But it's just like every day I just lie there. It's like, oh my gosh. It's obviously a real summer warm weather thing that I get. I don't know. Because it's been, I don't know. Who knows. Fibro just has a mind of its own and does what it wants. I do need to try and do a bit of food prep. I, I don't know. Yeah. We will just, I'll just share bits of bits of what I do because <laughs> I don't think it's going to be too much especially today things have gone pretty slow this morning but I had my shower I've gotten dressed I've um oh I've got two dogs to come running at me what do you two want I'm just talking to all of my friends I've hung out some washing on the back clothesline it's super windy and now that it's the weather's warming up it gets more sun and it'll dry real quick today. And Tara's got some stuff on this clothesline. There, so, I don't know. I'm feeling a bit on and off. I'm just trying to force myself to do a few things. So I'm gonna make some almond milk. We're we'll washing up to do. I'm gonna put some quinoa. And I'm thinking of making that course course and black bean salad that I used to make earlier this year that I really enjoyed. I think I might make some of that up too for lunch. And I've got a bit of a salad, so I can have it on my green salad and then that should be nice. So I'm gonna do that. And then we'll take Bailey to the vets. Tara's appointment that was this afternoon is now Wednesday. So we'll go to see a bit earlier, get our groceries, get home. So yeah, <laughs> still a bit of a full day, but I've got some new music to come out and I'm gonna listen to. So that will hopefully keep me going a little bit.
we're going to take Bailey to the vets. Got some envelopes to post, including our same sex marriage survey, waste of money thing that it is. <laughs> Get that in the mail. All right, I'm going to take Bailey to the vets. She's going to get the stitches out and I'm going to let Rosie go next door. But, got to work out. I think Bailey would be happy to go in the car anyway. <laughs> There's today's lunch. I've just got a basic salad and then I've got the, of course, of course, the black bean salad on top. Don't usually mix it all together. I usually just have lettuce, but I'll use up my salad. Yes, I Christy and Kevin have just got home and it's just 10 to 8. <laughs> This has been. What so did you do? We're doing it again tomorrow. The whole thing again tomorrow? Yeah. No. Oh. I'm not like going to town tomorrow. Well, you have to come home earlier. It's just not going to pick you up at 8 o'clock or 7 30 every you night. Everybody go home. Oh, Alright, come on, do your little haul. I've got a candle in dusk. Because Karen would have a little dusk. So, Chrissy went shopping. She went for a driving lesson. The driving instructor dropped her in town. How'd that go? Good. Good, and then you went to a movie, or shopping and a movie with a friend. Yeah. They probably know who Corinne is by now. Probably. Got a candle. It's a nice smell. It's pretty too. Oh, it is pretty, isn't it? I like, I like the container. Mmm, that's nice. That's... Tara's here too. Hello. <laughs> mm, nice. Yeah. So I got a candle. Got a little And I got some DVDs from. Oh. Well, it's got a nice little, nice little lid on it, hasn't it, too? This is where most of my money went. I didn't know you bought DVDs anymore. That one's got a DVD. Well, I have to, because I've watched oh, the, the, the anime ones, anime, yeah. yeah. So I've got Steins Gate. These are all ones that have been on my list to watch, by the mm -hmm. way. I've got Steins well, Gate. Christy had a lot of, a lot of money. Then <laughs> I got One House Co-Host Club, which I've already seen, but if they took it off, off Netflix, so I can't watch it legally anymore. Then I've got Divine Gate as well. And then fruits basket, which is one Dan recommended. Oh, that's good. That could be out of trouble for a while. Yeah, I've still got like four in there that I haven't watched, but I do have the discs off to watch. What a long list. Well, it's the holidays, so yeah. Yeah, that's that's my I also got a book on how to take care of candles. Because mm -hmm. <laughs> apparently I don't know how to do that. Candles are complicated. That's what I learned today. Oh, I also got I also paid for another a refill thing for your diffuser. No, oh a lighter. A lighter, because we have no lighters in this house. Oh, well, we do. They just always run out. Fire. Okay. Hurry up. Did you know you can get free free refills? All you do is take it in. Oh, ah, I didn't know that because your dad's bought me some from dusk. Yeah, so you have a free. Then this was Corinne's technically birthday present. Which is a really pretty drink bottle. From you, from Taipei. Yeah, they don't have nice drink bottles, don't they? Yes, I got that one from Corinne for my birthday present. That's very nice. Because oh, no. they've been looking for something for my birthday. What's that? Because the one I have at the moment is getting moldy, so I figured I may as well get yeah. one. Then I bought Gobstoppers, so I need Gobstoppers. Are they from Target? It's all from Target now? Gobstoppers. <laughs> and then I got Franks. What are Gobstoppers anyway? They're just. Candy. Oh. So I got that frame for upstairs to replace <laughs> the sister's one I got in my room with Fee and I. And then I got another one for downstairs. I got that one for downstairs. In there. It's good to put the picture that your That's friend Corinne's picture. made. Not Corinne. Heather's. Yeah. Heather's picture. That we showed already. Alright, I'm going to have dinner now. Because I am hungry. Which one's mine? Not 12. That one. So am I paying for you to get home tomorrow then? So it's got I got open it. Fried rice. We took you. Yummy. Good morning everyone. It is now Tuesday morning. I'm sitting here with Bailey. Just <laughs> giving him some pets. Rosie is there on the floor. Yeah you, Rosie. With the tissue that she found. <laughs> Uh, had a bit of a slow morning. Still not feeling amazing, but not the worst, so I just have to make the best of things and know that it's not too bad. Um, I don't know when I finished vlogging yesterday. I'm sorry. I'm so, I don't know, out of routine and I think, I don't know, I just find it harder to vlog with Tara around. Not, not blaming Tara. I mean, I do vlog with you around, but I just, I don't know, it's been a bit of out of sorts <laughs> with my vlogging.
But I did take, I can't remember the update on Bailey at the vets, but the vet said he's doing really well. He's actually further advanced than most dogs who have had the same surgery. So that was good news, but he's doing well. Um, still got another sort of four and a half weeks before he can start doing his walks and stuff. But we're still having to always tell him to slow down and take it easy because he just wants to go and do stuff. <laughs> but he's doing well, so that's the main thing. Um, yeah. So a bit of a slow morning. I kind of want to do some yoga. I was saying to Talia, so I have a bit of a problem because I feel better after a shower. So like now I feel like I want to go have a shower, so I'll feel a bit better to do my exercise, but then I get sweaty. <laughs> so it's like, oh. I'm not going to start having two showers every morning. It's not too, too hot today. So I guess if I get a little bit sweaty, it's not too bad. But it's like, oh. So I know the shower will just wake me up a bit more and it'll just help my pain levels. So I think I'm going to do that anyway. I think I'll go and shower, do my yoga, and then I'll have some breakfast. We ended up, oh yeah, I think I showed the fried rice last night, so I'm going to have some of that for breakfast and leftovers. And yeah, lunch is all organized because I've got my couscous and black bean salad to have for lunch. And I'm going to try, Tara's got an appointment at 11.30. I think when we come back from that, I'm going to make sure dinner's sorted as she should be right for tonight i'm going to do mashed potatoes and veggie roast for myself something for kevin and what else are they going to do oh it's some yorkshire puddings and some gravy so i have that for dinner tonight i think i did do my menu plan that's one thing i did work on yesterday afternoon with my little menu plan for the week so i've been a bit slack with food so it's been i don't know haven't been the most organized, but I have done the menu plan, so that's good. And I'm gonna try and make sure that I think a bit more about lunch earlier in the day. So even if just get out the instant pot or get out the pot, I'm gonna whatever, get all the stuff that's assembled, cut up anything I can cut up. Just get things ready to go. <laughs> I think that will help. I'll try and do that sort of after lunch if we're home. And I'm gonna go jump in the shower because I don't feel I could do yoga right now. I have to get changed anyway to do yoga, so I'll do it. Have my shower, and then, yeah, we'll just see. Ugh, gotta get groceries sometime today, too. Oh, you're finished. You just put the camera on, you're finished. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. It is now Wednesday. I think I was a big failure as a vlogger yesterday. <laughs> I don't even remember doing any filming besides saying good morning to you. Um, so sorry about that. Oh, I can't remember yesterday. I wasn't feeling the greatest and I just had to take Tara to an appointment. Tara wasn't having a good day so I just sort of, yeah, didn't really get much done. I did make some cheer cookies. I think it's a better I achieved and I made dinner. <laughs> My two very small achievements for the day. So today, Tara's got three appointments on and we're going to go visit Athena this afternoon. I do need to try and get at least some groceries, just depending on how I'm feeling. I've been battling a headache again, like a slight headache on and off and just body aches and pains. Just the usual fibro stuff. So I don't expect to get much done today either. I'm going to drag us upstairs for a shower in a moment and get ready. I just thought I'd better say good morning and check in for the day and I probably won't do much filming again because I said just lots of appointments I might try and take you guys along to visit Athena this afternoon <laughs> that's probably all I've got to share with you today but anyway thought I'd check in and if I do better I'll do better I'll try my best <laughs> I always do it's just yeah sometimes as I said before it just doesn't work out to be a good vlogging day which is why I decided to do a week this time around or at least five days or something the weekend might be separate because we are going down to Canberra for Saturday night um just from when we we're going to go a while ago we had to cancel and it was rebooked for this Saturday night so I figured we may as well go and just for the one night even though it's a long weekend and um use that accommodation we've already paid for and that would be nice just to get away anyway I'll um talk to you sometime good morning it's Thursday now. I just wanted to show you cute little Rosie. Isn't she cute? Oh, sleeping puppies are the cutest. 
Anyway, there you go. Good morning. Um, gonna try and be productive today. I don't have anything on to four o'clock. I need to remember. I've got to go to my beauticians at four o'clock. Oh, we might need to go and see Athena. But I've got nothing on this morning. I, uh, yeah, my feelings are but whatever. <laughs> not great, but not the worst. So we'll just go with <laughs> functional, maybe, would be the word. I think. I mean, I've been sitting on the couch since I got up, haven't I? So, um, but yeah, I think besides body aches, I think I'm not too bad. So I'm hoping I'm going to get my cleaning downstairs done today. That's today's the goal for today. And I was thinking, oh, excuse me, oh, <sighs> um, <laughs> I'm trying to do my Halloween decorations as well since. Is it not, it's not quite October, is it? So I don't do it today. I could do it next week, but I was thinking trying to do it today. Okay, so I'm going to clean. I might as well try and swap out the decorations because I have to take advantage of doing that. Oh, yeah, because it's the first on Sunday. So oh, it's only a few days away. So yeah, I think I'll try and do that today. But, yeah, I don't know. We'll just see. We go. Get my arms hold. It's all. My arm is still holding this camera. But anyway. Um, yesterday was a bit of a, another vlogging fail, wasn't it? So, well, um, yeah, we're just in and out so much with appointments. We were only home, like we left at quarter to, no, we left at half past nine or something. I don't know, back, I don't know what time we left. Just before half past nine. Oh my God, why are we so tired? Oh, I was really tired yesterday too. Um, yeah, we left just before half past nine. And we didn't end up getting home until about half past four. We were briefly in to drop off some groceries, but that was it. We had a very productive day. I mean, it was all pretty much Katara. I got my gro well, a little grocery shop, my grocery essentials, because we had, we were limited on time. So I had to race around and get the things that I really needed yesterday. So we did that. I'll probably need to go again tomorrow and get the rest of the stuff that I didn't get, but that's okay. Um... Yeah, and I did mean to film when we went to visit Athena, but I totally forgot. I thought it was just a crazy day. Um, so today is not so crazy. Uh, and I'm not sure about tomorrow. I haven't looked at tomorrow yet. It's been a crazy week, really, because obviously I've had to take Tara to all her appointments. Um, I wish there were many. Between, I don't know how Tara and Athena do it when Athena's got all her appointments as well. That's why they have crazy weeks, because they both have so many appointments um but anyway <laughs> i was gonna say something else and i don't know what it was so anyway i'll try and come back to you guys i'm actually doing something i'm so sad one of my favorite bands oh my gonna be away <laughs> okay you'll have to excuse my beautiful appearance I'm hot and sweaty and trying to get some cleaning done, but I'm feeling pretty big and tired. We just had someone turn up to, well, two guys turn up to look at both the shower screens because the house has moved a bit. I think when after our leak that we had almost two years ago, it's dried out. The walls have moved a bit and the shower screen's now not closing properly. So looking at just replacing the shower screen, starting from scratch again. I think they're about $400 each, so that's not too bad. Well, I'm sure the other would be, one would be dearer than the other, but considering they're tw nearly 12 years old, I guess if we get another 12 years out of them, that's not so bad. I don't believe we'll be here in 12 years <laughs> because they could like shave a bit off, but then they're probably going to move again and we'll be back to square one. So, anyway, I have started decorating for Halloween. Kevin goes, Why are you using your spoons on this? But I'm cleaning and putting stuff out, and I've only got two tubs of Halloween stuff. So it isn't as bad as it sounds. And obviously I want to have my things that only come out once a year like that. And we've got our, where did he go? Where did Jack Skellington go? Huh? Um, oh, over there on the heater. <laughs> so I'll show you anyway. I doubt I'll do a home tour because I, we don't do full on decorations like we used to. But I'll probably, I'll probably just do it as a part of a vlog. Maybe not today, I don't know. I'll see how we go. You seen the front of the tree anyway? Because I haven't got the coffee table anymore, I've got some more stuff to put out places. So but I'm really tired. I'm going to try and finish dusting here. Get this room done and decorated. 
have a rest and then vacuum. I was going to set up the camera and show you as I did stuff, but I don't think I can be bothered doing that quite frankly. <laughs> Sorry. Um, I just want to get this done. I'm sort of not feeling great. My tummy's going a bit stupid now that I'm not moving around. Yeah, it kind of works out because Tara's not here. She's gone out to an appointment. So I thought I've got the house to myself. Oh no, Christy's here. I forget she's here because she's usually in a room. Well, she's been out the last two days pretty much. Actually, she's been out the last three days pretty much. She's seen the movie It three times now, the last three days. Twice with her friend Corinne. And she went by herself yesterday when Nana Pop wrote an appointment. She had a day out with Nana Pop yesterday. And when they were an appointment, she went to the movies. <laughs> and she wanted to go again today. I said, no, I think three paying to see it three times is quite enough. You know, you can wait until it comes out and we can get on different resources. Um, <laughs> yeah. Anyway, she's home. I did see briefly when the... Um, the shower screen guys were here. Please report. I've got all downstairs cleaned. Even mopped the floors, which is something I don't quite get to. So I had a little rest. I was resting in between, so it's now 20 past 12. I'm gonna go have a shower because we want to leave about one o'clock, I think. That feels a bit better, a bit fresher. It was a good decision to wait and have my shower after all my cleaning. So I do feel nice and fresh. I, I'm going for a facial at four o'clock, so I haven't bothered doing eyebrows or anything like that. I've just pulled my hair back because it's going to get all messy again and oily after my facial. But I'm tired, but it's okay. I just have to relax now. So that's what I'm going to do for lunch. Um, might make something here or stop and buy something. I think it's requested I take in some kale because I do a bit of cooking up there like so there's like physical therapy and stuff so they're doing some cooking and then you want to make kale chips I think they want to make kale chips so something with some kale and possibly something for lunch unless I can think of something here I've got that couscous salad but I'm not really feeling like that today <laughs> so anyway I'll um, have a think about that I'm so tired but it's okay because we're going to visit Athena and then driving up driving back and visiting Athena and then going for my facial so and dinner tonight planned was I've forgotten about my facial it was a planned one it's just I filled pasta so it's got to boil the water and cook the pasta and a corn cob but simple easy dinner tonight so that was good <laughs> um yeah anyway so if I don't share any, I'll try and take I'll take the camera I'll try and get some more but in case I forget because I'm really bad at the minute Oscar probably shouldn't but I was considering doing vlogtober thinking that might help me to vlog every day and get back in the swing of like some decent vlogs for you guys because I feel like I've been pretty slack lately but I think it's just been crazy time and I don't know that it's really a feasible thing to try and vlog every day anyway <laughs> I'll still think about it some more anyway, I'm gonna go and sit down so I'm up here visiting a fee obviously Tara's here too maybe one of you point out yeah. that Nan bought me flowers yeah and then mum bought me kale. We bought you a bunch of kale. <laughs> <laughs> I think they did request it. Because uh -huh. <laughs> you're going to make kale chips tomorrow. I, I think I might have already vlogged that. I think I already yeah. said that. But it's funny. Because I know, it's the Taris that we're taking her a bunch of kale. <laughs> taking them a bunch of kale. <laughs> it's like a little thing in everything. I know. Like a little flower cake. <laughs> but these doing well. It's a two hydro sessions today. Yes, it's the second day out of four days of that. Yeah, you, don't, you don't often do the, the second one, do you? Because you find that you're pretty sore. So I get really bad headaches in the afternoon. I get just exhausted. Mm -hmm. I almost didn't. I got yelled at for not, not wearing the socks. <laughs> Again? Again. <laughs> Hot socks. They would just say, wear the socks. And I'm like, well, if you would like to sit here and put three pairs of socks on me so I can <laughs> go downstairs without having a meltdown, you're welcome to do it. But if I call a nurse, it'll take 20 minutes and then I'll be out of hydro time. That's a great story. I know, it frustrates me. I'm like, what are the socks for again? I can't remember. So no one. Slip on the pool. Oh, that's right. So no one else would know. But yes. In the pool. To go to, to, get, the, pool. to, go to the pool. You and can't then take them off. Yes. Can't walk around well, I can't with bare cope feet. With the socks. So I have to put on my compression stockings, my normal socks, then their socks. <laughs> and I can't do that three times Just a day. Just to take them all off again. <laughs> Poor thing. So I'm like. <laughs> If you want to see, if a nurse wants to come in and spend their time <laughs> doing that twice a day, because I can do it about once, I don't do it three times, then they're welcome. No nurse wants to do that and they never come on time. Okay. So, Say goodbye. Bye. Bye. <laughs>
A story time's over. <laughs> You're so mean. <laughs> Sorry, I disappeared all afternoon. I'm just in, had my facial, as you can probably tell. You got a very glamorous meal day today, didn't you? <laughs> First, it was like um, cleaning hair, and now it's post facial hair. I don't. Uh, I hope you can see it. Right. I haven't got the screen up, but yeah, it's beautiful afternoon out there now. It's um, oh my gosh, it says 28 degrees. I think it last. Well, I think when I went in, it was 26, and now it's 28, and it's quarter past five in the evening. It's such a kind of a shame that I wasn't home this afternoon because it's a beautiful, beautiful afternoon. The skies are gorgeous as well. Look, you can see the sky. Oh, beautiful skies. So it's a gorgeous afternoon. It would be lovely just to sit outside, but anyway, I got to have a nice relax in my facial. Yeah, heading home now, and I'll um, see you guys there. I'm back home. Mr. Whistler has got himself a new toy. Uh-uh-uh, puppy, stay in there. I haven't flown it yet. It's a nice night to fly it. Look at the size of it. Why can it not take off? It's so small. It's a lot smaller than the last one. It's a beautiful night. Maybe the people won't yell at you this time like they did last time when you had your drone up in the sky. Do you remember the getting yelled at, Daddy? Oh, yes, it's been on a firmer update before. I can. It's not oh. going to fly now. Well, this is anticlimactic, isn't it? Oh, I wonder why the motorhome door was open. I was sitting down. <laughs> but it's teeny tiny, smaller than smaller than a foot. All right, I'm going back inside then. Are you ready for dinner soon? Or are you playing? No, I shouldn't Okay. Puppies are ready for dinner, aren't you? Oh yeah, I'll let them take off. Someone's back in the cone of shame. Not for his, well, it's for the leg that got operated on, but not for his operation side. He's got a sore further down his leg that he's been licking and nuzzling and licking again. And now it's a nice mess. We'll have to take it to the vets now. Again. Why not bail you? But um, Tara wants to be a vet, a vet nurse anyway, so she's been um, wrapping his leg up for him, looking after him. Good morning everyone, it's Friday and it's the end of the week. How did that happen? I do not know. Anyway, <laughs> um, I'm not sure whether this vlog will be part of the weekly vlog or a separate one, because I don't know how much footage I've got, so we'll just see. And I'm feeling... I believe I'm feeling pretty good today. The mornings are always rough. So when I get up, I always, yeah, I always feel bad. <laughs> I couldn't tell you the last time I woke up and felt good first thing in the morning. And it's been worse as the weather has warmed up, but that's okay. I've taken all my meds now. I've been up for, I don't know, a good hour or so. I'm up to a cup of tea number two. So I've been up for at least an hour. And I think I'm feeling all right today, which means I can get upstairs cleaned, which is really good. Um, so I've got this morning, this morning free, and then Tara's got appointments this afternoon, and we've got to go see Fee. I was supposed to take a bag of stuff yesterday, and I had it on my bag hook, and I took it off, and I had it in my hand, and then I got sidetracked and decided to put some things from the washing machine into the dryer, and I put the bag down, and forgot to put the bag back up, so I didn't get to th take Fee her bag of stuff yesterday, but we'll do that today. So, yeah, I'm, I'm happy, I'm feeling good. Um, as I said, it's just been a bit up and down, but overall, I've been really good. I'm not complaining. I really, I hope it doesn't come across as complaining. I just sort of report in how I'm feeling, so you guys kind of know. Because unfortunately, with a chronic illness, how you feel at any moment is a big part of your life. It's a big part of your day. You know, you can put it aside and move on and do things, but. It's, you constantly have to evaluate how you're feeling so you know what you're capable of doing. Unfortunately, so <laughs> I just tend to update you guys from obviously always just thinking to myself, how do I feel now? Oh yeah, I feel good, I can go do stuff and I just inform you guys of that stuff too. Anyway. Get my cup of tea. We have some cheap cookies because I did get them made the other day. And wait till the time goes by because it's still only 6 o'clock in the morning. 
so I'm hoping that maybe about 7.30 if I'm still feeling decent I will um, go a it's not going to be as hot today, I don't think, so I might be able to... No, I'm not going to shower first, but I'm going to clean the shower screen. Although, if we're getting it replaced, is there any point? Hmm. Maybe there's no point in cleaning the shower screens now. Anyway, I've got to clean the tiles and stuff in the shower, and I'll clean the bathroom and stuff. I think I'll have my shower at the end of doing that, so... 7.30, maybe 8 at the latest. I will go upstairs and... Get started by cleaning. Hopefully, I've got all morning. Ah, we'll see. We'll see how things go. Um, yeah, so that's all I have to report because I've been vlogging pretty regularly. Still considering October. I don't know. Because I'll be vlogging a fair bit in November, obviously, as well, because we've got, we've got the week in Melbourne. And then um, my trip, my God, I can't believe, like, in a few days, I'll be saying. Our trip is next, next, not the Melbourne trip, but our Vegas, Hawaii trip is next month. Uh, I do not feel at all organized for this trip. I mean, all our major things are booked, like our accommodations booked. Some shows are booked for Vegas. That's what we all need to do in Vegas, I think. Yeah, I don't need to do any more in Vegas. Uh, but the things I want to do, I've, had, I've got some lists partly. I've got a lot of stuff pinned. I need to go through all that. And usually the school holidays is when I sort of do that, but I've had to be you know, take time at all the appointments, so. Haven't we had the time? <laughs> and I'm so far behind on YouTube. Because <laughs> I'm obsessed with cleaning videos. So, I've been watching lots of them. Plus my normal vlogs. Oh my God, I'm all over the place at the moment. Too much I'm interested in. And then I've started to work on a budget. So we're watching budgeting videos. Like, I don't need any more interests. On top of the, that's on top of all the normal stuff that I've, or I've always been interested in, so. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's good, but I think I'm up to nearly 300 videos in my to watch list. And because I've been productive around the house and getting stuff done and then having appointments, I haven't had a lot of YouTube time. Oh well. Yeah, I have to give a clean out again, but I'm trying. <laughs> this is videos I want to watch, and a lot of just like cleaning ones you watch anyone, anytime, or cooking ones, or a lot of things that aren't really time critical. So. I can keep them, but when I'm ever going to watch them, I don't know. Anyway, yeah, too much, too many interests. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to get that cup of tea now. Okay, before I went upstairs, I wanted to get the dog's dinner done. So I've got a heap of vegetables I had sort of left over in the fridge, um, including potatoes. And then I've, I've just put a, some lentils and some barley and a pack of the spaghetti in there for them for their pasta. So I'm just going to spoiled now. So I'm going to turn that off and just put the lid on and just let it sort of absorb all that liquid and cook the the other stuff and then that will cool down. I had to cool do it now because it's going to be a busy afternoon. So I want to get that done. And I want to get, that'll be three or four nights worth in there. Probably three, it's not as much as sometimes, but there is some quinoa in the fridge too. I'll probably add to one of the dishes, add to either a bit to each or whatever. Anyway, I'll make three or four dinners out of that. So I think I'm going to go upstairs and start my cleaning now. As you can see, I'm up in the bedroom. I've just changed into some cleaning clothes because I know I'm going to get pretty sweaty. I'm going to clean the bathrooms and shower screens. And it's quite warm, but not warm enough for air conditioning. So I'll just manage and I'll have my shower later on. So I've just, I should have probably showed you guys this mess before. I might have already showed you in another vlog, but Kevin had a lot of mess. So I've just sorted his mess into a pile. At least it means I can give that area a good vacuum. And I've sort of cleared off. Oh my god, it's never ending. He did give me permission because he doesn't want to do these drawers. So I have permission to sort these drawers out. Oh my gosh, what is hearing aid batteries? <laughs> so that's going to be a fun job because most of it's probably just going to go into a bag and we give them to Kevin. And look, he's such a mess up. I think this is just rubbish. I was going to keep this for. Um, donation stuff so I've got a few things I know like that's to donate the backpacks to go back downstairs and some my spare keys are up here I don't know why Kevin had them here so at least I've kind of cleared up I will do a proper declutter one other day at least that looks a bit more presentable because it was driving me batty but I just hadn't got around to it yet so anyway that's done and I've done his side of the bed and bedroom and now I've got to do my side and I've got a few Christmas presents and stuff there as well 
So I'll finish making my bed and getting this side tidied up. Okay, I apologize for not setting up a camera. I'm just a bit time poor. What I promise when I've got time and I'm doing a cleaning, I will film some more. I'll set the camera up and film it properly. Okay, the bathroom is done for the most part. I just have to do in the shower. I'm gonna leave that till I actually have my shower. But like I did that mirror and to the vanity, to the floor, to be mopped. All the stuff's put away. So room looks a lot better. I'm about to turn that fan off now and finish in here. I've also vacuumed in here as well. So I'm gonna go have breakfast and have a little break now. Okay, Tara's room is all done. Well, back here, have you seen like Tara sleeps in here when Athena's not here because she's not sleeping in the other bed by herself? But um, this is just her hangout room with all schoolwork and all that stuff. I'm sure she won't mind me sharing it with you. It's lovely, I've always liked this room. This is my exercise room. And well, that one's done. And these rooms done. I need to do good dust. I haven't like done a detailed clean, we've just dusted all the surfaces and, and vacuumed pretty much. So it was actually tidy. <laughs> and Chrissy's room is always tidy. I haven't dusted hers yet. I'm about to do hers. She only just got up. So I'm about to do this one, but as you can see, tidy. We shouldn't have made a bed yet, but it was like Christian just got up. But besides that, Chrissy's room is very tidy. It's always neat and tidy. Bathroom's all done. Floor's wet, but I replaced the towels and well done. That looks nice. Again, there's some marks that probably need scrubbed on the floor, but it's clean. Ah, I'm so tired. I'm so hot and sweaty. So, you can see I'm just sweating. I'm so glad I didn't have my shower first. So oh, I've still got to vacuum the stairs. I'm going to take some stuff down, vacuum the stairs. Then I might have a cold drink, a little rest, then my shower and have my shower. So clean my shower, have my shower, and get ready. And make myself look a bit less oily and sweaty. <laughs> I'm done with all the cleaning except for the shower. <laughs> I'm so tired. I just had another little rest. And it certainly feels good. I do enjoy my cleaning. Oh, sorry guys. Oh. <laughs> sorry, just accidentally knocked my phone. <clears throat> so I'm gonna give this shower just a little clean. Best I can. And then get ready. We've got to head out. I could show me some lunch for myself because I don't think we're going back until um, hmm. four or five, depending on how long we stay with the thing, Athena. So, oh, I'm actually going to take Bailey to the vets Why Tara's at her appointment. I forgot when I was doing that, so I've got to take him with us. Oh, that's not going to work. I guess I wasn't coming home after that. Oh, okay. Can't do that then. I'm not to take him tomorrow morning or later on tonight. Oh, I'm glad I realised I can't take him to the vets. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Back to the original plan. There you go. Do I look a bit more presentable now? <laughs> My hair done. I'm even blow dried it today because I thought it's so late in the day. I mean, I'm drying pretty fast, but it'll be there for a while. And oh, sorry, I forgot to stop my music. My song was just finishing. Um. My eyebrows. Psoriasis has finally made its way into my eyebrows. I don't know if you can, well, you can probably see they're quite red. So, no, oh, sorry, too blurry for me. Um, yeah, you can sort of see. So that means a lot of the hairs from the end of my eyebrows, like I've touched them up now because they're just, there's not much hair left at the end. So even when I got them tinted yesterday, they still don't look good. I sort of, I sort of got about three, two thirds of an eyebrow, pretty much, and a little few hairs. So I'm obviously going to have to touch them up all the time now, which is a bit annoying. I had such nice eyebrows, and we we're kind of blaming the fact that I'd been to some different beauticians for a few months when, well, seven months or so when Fran was off on maternity leave. But I think it's actually the psoriasis. So possibly a bit of both. But I would have thought now I've been back with Fran for a number of months, and I would have thought the hair would be coming back but filling in a bit more but it doesn't seem to be so I think it probably is the psoriasis so I've left my psoriasis cream on the bench to try and make sure I put it on every night see if it makes a difference I don't know I would say <laughs> it's probably finished now before I've got hopeless eyebrows now <laughs> after being so careful I've never touched them myself ever 
I've always gone to a professional beautician <laughs> to get them done because my mum overplucked her eyebrows and I was obviously par always paranoid that I would do the same thing but I think it's just naturally <laughs> happened anyway. Oh well, I've got bigger problems really than that. Not a big issue, put a bit of a bright brow pencil on and be fixed it up a bit. All right, I'm dressed. I've got enough time to make myself some lunch and then take that, so yeah. I'm gonna say a quick good night now. I'm just done dinner. We're having veggie fajitas. Um, watch some TV and I'm gonna finish this up now so I don't forget <laughs> and so I can get it edited and hope you got loaded in the morning before we head off to Canberra. So any of my fellow New South Walesians, Wales and Wellians, I don't know what you want to call yourselves. <laughs> Anyone who lives in New South Wales, hope you have a good long weekend. I think it's saying New South Wales. It's the Queen's birthday weekend. No, it's not. It's Labor Day weekend. Labor Day weekend, which I don't know what that means either. <laughs> Just one of those public holidays that we get. Anyway, we're off to Canberra and um, I'll see you guys down there. Bye.